So you want to add mains powered smoke detectors in your property. How easy is that? Well, let's take a look. This sort of job should always be done by a qualified electrician. It's not just about wiring, but it's about safety for everyone in the home. First up, smoke detector at the bottom of the stairs. We measure at least 300 millimeters away from the light fitting, and that's straight from the manufacturer's guidance. We're taking our power from the ceiling rows. The cable is passed through first time and then wired into the smoke detector. In the kitchen, it's a heat detector. Same process the cable is coming from the nearest light fitting and always in the same joist space that makes cable routing a breeze finally the lock and I've used a heat detector again to maintain an IP2X rating we're boarding off the eaves and this stops anyone from accessing the terminations from behind the fitting and this is essential for compliance and here's something important you may have noticed we've only connected line and neutral to each alarm that means they're not interlinked and if one goes off the other stay silent and to find out how I interlink these smoke alarms without running a single extra cable, then be sure to follow the link in the description.